Ask any player and you'll always find the same, how do you call this, origin story. At some point, that guy fell head over heel for a girl. Either he got that girl, couldn't get that girl, couldn't hold that girl. Something happened and it quote unquote broke his heart. As I said in my previous flows, heart was already broken, but now the brokenness was officialized. She officialized the truth. After that brokenness happens or is expressed or is revealed, what does a guy say? Some guys at least, some, some, some suckers want to just keep on acting the same way. Most guys decide that from now on, they're going to play the game because it's a game somehow, but they're not going to get caught. They become players. That means how am I going to get some pussy? How am I going to get some love, some attention, some praise, some admiration? How am I going to be worshipped by a bunch of bitches without getting caught? How am I going to be the man? How am I going to be untouchable at the end of the day? I'm just going to get what I want, which is attention, praise, validation, status, some kind of bullshit like that. I'm going to be a player technically. How am I going to suck from her without getting sucked on? That's what I'm truly, truly trying to say. So at the end of the day, that's what a player is. He's trying to suck on a bitch. He's trying to take as much as possible and not get caught. And on the other side, if you're a player and you hang out with a, some kind of woman, sometimes they're innocent because they, they, they don't have a lot of experience in the game. But as you get older, women that you meet now have experience in the game. And now we in the real, it's like a tennis match. Who's going to steal from who? So we have two people, both wounded, trying to suck on one another. And who's going to out-hustle the other one? So anyways, the point of what I'm trying to say is that generally it all starts from a heartache. You get your heart broken. As I said before, your heart is, is already broken. But as far as you're concerned, your heart gets broken. And now you cover it up. You start, listen carefully, building facades as a young guy you start you enter your teens uh, you, you don't have an identity you just you just you're just an awkward little fellow whose sexuality is barely ripened and uh, you don't know anything about anything and then you need to you want to create some kind of like facade identity so that people can kind of relate to you and you can also more importantly protect yourself protect your vulnerability but key word man protect your sensitivity you want to protect your sensitivity from the quote-unquote grown-ups world, which is full of sharks. Everybody's out there to try to steal and take from you. So you, 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 you get a little sense of that. You want to protect yourself. So you start building facades. You start grooming your hair in a particular way, dressing in a kind of way, listening to kind of music, and portraying a facade, some kind of an identity, which has got nothing to do with who you really are. It's something that you borrow or steal, or it doesn't matter what it is, but it's fake. That's what it is. And it may suit you to a certain degree, but it's still fake because it's not who you really are. And that from that point on, you start to desensitize yourself. You, your sensitivity starts to disappear. It gets buried. So that's what a player is. A player is a guy who's broken. He was already broken like most of us are. Then covered it up with a facade and decided to live at the level of the facade. Then took his facade, trained his facade, f uh, learned how to master his facade so that he can suck as, mo as much as possible from other people. He's going to suck from women some innocent women and some women players and he's going to also suck from you the guy who doesn't understand the nature of the game and who sees him and admires him and maybe even buys a course from him on how to get quote unquote pussy now he's not getting pussy all he's getting is a hole and he thinks that that's pussy there's no pussy there it's a hole you could take your fucking hands put your cock in it and that would be the same put lubricant of course and then you can just be an illusion that you got pussy he's not getting yoni He's getting nothing. He's just getting a hole. That's not what sexual relationships are truly about. There's another potential. And they have no idea what it is. They barely, barely know. But they can con you. They're trying to con you to make you believe that they actually figured it out. When in reality, all they are are bona fide players. Now, I, I can't remove that. I was a player. I understood exactly the nature of the game. It's a facade. You are just playing. That's nothing, there's nothing more to that. And as a player, you interact with a woman who doesn't give a fuck about you. All she cares about is what you look like and what she will look like in front of her little world. That's all she cares about. Everybody using everybody. So you, if you have a heart, you know what you're going to get? You're going to get, it's going to hurt you even more because you have to make, you have to be hard. And you care about people because you're a sensitive person. Everybody cares about everybody at a deeper level. And here you are now trying to take something from a girl that you can quite obviously see is in some kind of pain and anguish. And you're not able to help her or facilitate any well-being for her because you're, you're, you're a thief. 
you're a thief that may have a moment of like compassion for the person you're going to steal, but you're still going to steal. You're not there enriching. Fucking key word, man. Enriching her life. You're not enriching her, her life. You're giving her the illusion that you're enriching her life, but you're not. All you're doing is playing. And even in your sexual act, you are pretending to give her love. You're not. You're pretending to give her pleasure. You're not. And if she was honest, and she's not going to be honest, and she may be honest, she's going to say, it sucked. And go see my homeboy who studies the statistics of women that get off with a man on a, on a hookup. Or they don't get off, women. They don't enjoy it because there's no love. They can't relax, brother. It's all a sham. So tell me, you still want to be a player or you want to learn how to be a real man?